How many axolotl squishies do they make? I think I got all of them, so let's take a look. Don't wait for tomorrow. Hey guys, it's Dr. Squish. Welcome back. Uh, today, I have got something ugly cute. Axolotls got really popular several years ago because they're the cutest little guys. And I don't think I'd ever even heard of an axolotl until I moved to Japan and they sell them as pets for some reason, which I feel like is a bad idea. But I didn't even know they were called axolotls because in Japan, they're called whooper loopers. Woo, woo. But I fell in love with their ugly, cute little faces. They're so adorable. You guys know that I love creepy, cute, ugly, cute animals. Well, of course, toy makers get in on the trends, all the trends, and axolotls are no different. So I found every axolotl squishy I could possibly find, and we are going to go take a look and see what we think. Okay, I don't actually have links for anything, so I'm just gonna try and tell you where I got everything today so that you guys can find it if you want to. Look at all of the stuff! Holy cow, that is a big old axolotl haul. I can't believe there were so many cute axolotl things out there, but I'm just gonna start grabbing and showing you and telling you where I got it all. First off, I found a couple things at Books A Million. We went to Books A Million and I wasn't expecting to find any axolotl things, but there was cute axolotl stuff there. I had to buy Locky the axolotl. So adorable. Locky's gonna be like our little beanie mascot for today, for the, the video. Look how cute it is, oh my goodness. These also came from Books A Million. They are the Soft and Slow Squishies Axolotls Blind Bags. I paid $3.99, obviously, at Books A Million, and it looks like there are six that you can get. They're all food themed. I really want that burger axolotl. So let's see if I have any luck today. Oh, there's bunches in here. Holy cow, I thought I was getting one squishy. I mean, it says there's three, but there's three in there. So cute. I don't know if this is supposed to be a little cake or what. They don't smell at all. He's so cute. Yay, boba axolotl. A boba lotl, if you will. These are not slow rising. Even though the name of them is soft and slow, they're not at all. They're very firm squishies. They're cute, but not slow rising. Look at this little pistachio avocado ice cream. <laughs> That's what he looks like to me. I don't know what he's supposed to be. All right, well, I didn't really realize I was getting three. So it'd be really cool if I got the other three. If I get the same ones, I'm gonna be a bit bummed out. I just thought they were gonna be bigger and only one. Here we go. Yes, I got the popcorn. Oh, he's so cute. For some reason, this one's way squishier than the others. I wish he smelled like popcorn. That's so cute. Yes! <laughs> Oh, he's so adorable. Oh, that just makes the whole show. Does that mean that I got the, it does. You guys, I got so lucky. I only bought two of these bags, had no idea there was three each and that they were gonna be the whole entire collection. So man, I lucked out. I guess I could have very easily gotten uh, just a bag of doubles. These are all so cute. First axolotls of the day, totally worth it from Books A Million. I think that these were worth four bucks. I don't know, maybe you don't, but I think they're cute enough that they were. I love these. So this next item actually came from Top Trends. It's the only item I have today that I didn't purchase myself. Top Trends sent me a whole entire box of their super duper sugar squishers. And there happened to be an axolotl in there, so I pulled it out from my axolotl show. This is the only thing that I didn't buy. This is from Top Trends, which I think you can get all over the place. And this is Abby the axolotl. Oh, she's stuck. Okay. <gasps> And Abby, okay, there's Abby. She's translucent and very squishy. Oh yeah, Abby is so squishy, look. Oh my gosh. Well, these sugar squishies are like the best thing that's happened to squishies in a really long time. I absolutely love all of these. I'm so glad they started making them. It looks like she's got a little bubble. I thought she was holding a heart, but no. This is my first Top Trends super duper sugar squisher. She's amazing. Okay, my next few items came straight from Amazon. Look at these two. <gasps> They're so adorable. Oh my gosh, you guys look. Yes, I love it. It reminds me of the Taba squishies. It's not, it's a 
these ones are glittery, but this is not a sugar squishy. It kind of looks like it. I thought it might actually also have water beads, but it doesn't. It's got some kind of gel and glitter. Listen, you guys, that's good stuff. You know how I am. You know I'm wanting to cut this chubby little axolotl open and see what's inside because I can't exactly tell if you are missing Dr. Squish cutting open squishies, all of the cutting open squishy videos are now over on Doc's Playhouse. So if you've been missing the old Dr. Squish cutting open squishy videos, that's where they are, Doc's Playhouse. Go check it out. I see glittery gel, I see foam beads, and I see like confetti glitter stars. So there's a lot going on in these little bitty squishies. These were so cool and they came in a two pack uh, on <laughs> on Amazon. That's amazing. Now is the time when I stop the show to ask you to please subscribe to Dr. Squish if you have not done so. And if you unsubscribe, please subscribe back. I will try to be less awkward, maybe. So I got more sugar balls. These came in a four pack from Amazon. Look, oh yeah, <laughs> it's really cute. It's a little bit bigger than this one but this one does have the malt syrup inside. So it is, it kind of stays in its shape and then slowly returns. It's kind of liquidy, kind of slimy, kind of sticky. These are very cool. And I actually do really love the chunky glitter in the clear syrup. They're not as soft, I don't think, even as the top trends, but they're pretty soft. These get like an eight out of 10. These are cute. Look, little face. All right, my last one's from Amazon is this pack. It says there's four in here as well. Axolotl squishies, stretchy stress balls. So let's see. Look at my box of axolotls. These are such interesting colors. I have a lot of pink and I have a lot of blue, but this one is like orange, fleshy color. <laughs> this one is teal. I have a white one. Okay, look at that little face. This actually looks like a real axolotl, just really, really chubby. I don't think this is a sugar squishy. It doesn't say it is, so let's see. Oh, <gasps> no! He's got like whipped cream inside. He's so cute. Okay, so this box of axolotls was totally worth getting. They're so soft. So that the skin on them is actually super soft and they're really cute. They're just your basic like cream filled squishies. I actually love the kind of different colors of all of these. These get like eight and a half out of 10. They're awesome. You wanna know what all that is? I actually went to Mrs. Bench's website, which is fidgettoysplus.com, and I looked up axolotl squishies, and this is all I got from her store. So everything else came from fidgettoysplus.com, and it's crazy how much there actually was. So it looks like to me that everything left, everything I got from Mrs. Bench actually is called Ugly Cute. So it's Ugly Cute. This one is Popeye axolotls, and I'm almost positive that all of this ugly cute stuff is from Jaru. So they made a whole bunch of ugly cute, adorable axolotl fidgets and squishies. So I think that's what these all are. They're really, really adorable. Here's my purple Popeye axolotl. I love him so much. Are you guys ready? <laughs> oh my gosh. I love him. He's amazing. Oh, he's so fun. Pick one, babe, pick one. <laughs> I said I thought everything was ugly cute. This one's not. So this one is another sugar squishy. I have a lot of them on my show lately, adorable sugar squishies, but this one was the only one from Mrs. Bench. And this one is bigger. So these are the ones that I got from Amazon. This one is really a lot bigger and it's got different colors. It's got a cuter little face. So, you know, it just depends on which one you think you want. Whoa, okay, that was actually really unexpected. Now, hold on. If we're talking about slime and putty, do you understand what I mean by that? Slime is soft and stretchy and putty is firm and stretchy. Does that make sense? If these are slime, then this is putty. It's really soft and it's really stretchy, but it's way firmer than this one. So it's like the syrup that's in these is a lot thicker, if that makes any sense. It's not unpleasant, it's really cool. Look at that. This is like the slowest slow rising squishy. Mrs. Bench didn't send me these. She probably doesn't even know I bought them. I bought them, you know, without telling anybody. But that's really cool, it's so different. I would think that the sugar squishies would be the same, but they're just not. You can see how much more quickly this one goes back to its shape than this one does. 
So that is very interesting to me. I was thinking I may have too many sugar squishies, but nope, this is different. Time for some water bead axolotl. It's still the ugly cutest is globby axolotl. These are full of water beads, but look how cute they are. Yep, it's stretchy. <laughs> it's so squishy. Whoa, buddy. Okay, look. <laughs> how are you doing? I'm fine, how are you? Oh, we're stuck. Yep. These are fun squishies. There's not a lot going on with them. They're like your basic water bead squish. They look a little less like axolotls and a little more like some kind of segmented bug. <laughs> so, I don't know. These are not as cute as some of the other ones I have from today. So let's keep, let's keep looking. Alrighty. I have a package of ugly, cute, delish to squish. So these look like mochis. And it says this is a two pack. And it looks like there are six different ones that you could get. So let's just go ahead and get them out. Oh my gosh. Look at his little derpy face. Croissant. <laughs> they both have derpy faces. So these are basic, basic mochi squishies, but with the adorableness of an axolotl added. And it's axolotls on sweets. You guys know that I don't like mochi squishies, but these have the added adorableness of axolotls and sweets. My favorite is that even on the picture, you can tell they're not Photoshop because every one of them has like a derpy face and they're all different. <laughs> these two are the same thing. It says ugly cute, Smushy axolotl. I have a purple one and a teal one. Okay, look at how cute it is with this little mwah face. Okay, you ready? It's a sand axolotl. Yes, it is. It's so good. It reminds me of the ugly babies, which are also ugly cute. I love her. She gets a nine and a half out of 10. I don't know what it is, but I love these sand squishies. <laughs> they're so funny to me. I mean, they're, they just, ugh, they're perfect. These are like my favorite ones so far. Next up is not a squishy, but I couldn't resist it. It says ugly cute, cool shades. This one is called the pop and play axolotl. I can tell that it is a pop tube. But look at that little face. How could I leave him there when I'm having an axolotl show? He said he wanted to come. It looks like there's a whole bunch of different styles because not only are there different colors and different glasses, but this one is a pop tube like what I got. And then this one is a slinky. Okay, his little face is so cute. I'm so glad I got him for this show and his little feet and his little gills and his little glasses, they don't come off. And I think all he is like nothing else moves is a pop tube. Yeah. And Pop tube, he's so short. I was I was about to like snatch him. No. Okay. He's pretty cute. It's not that loud because both of the ends are covered up. And look at him. Look. Oh my gosh. How can you be how can you not like him? I like him a lot. These are also, well, I guess they are squishy technically, but they're not squishies like stress toys. It's called Ugly Cute Fly-In Axolotls 2-Pack. I love that it says it may permanently stick to or stain surfaces. Just so you know. Okay, first impressions. You guys, I love the colors. I think out of everything I've gotten today, I may love these colors the most, which is crazy. I love the purple and light blue, and I love this teal and lime green. Ugh, that's so good. All right. Yes. <laughs> I don't want it to go all the way across the studio. Hold on. Oh. So good. Ready? So good. These are like amazing. Here we go. Yes. I mean, they work really well. They're not like rubber bands or something. Ugh. They not only work, but they kind of go exactly where you want them to. I know they're not squishies, but I kind of want to give them a 10 out of 10. Since they're not, and this is a squishy day, I'm going to give them nine and a half out of 10. These are fun. I love these so much. Ah! Squishy flinging axolotl goodness! 
I didn't even think I would like those. Like, I didn't think that that was going to get a very high rating today because it's not even a squishy. And usually those kind of things don't work and they're kind of cheap and cheesy. So I'm loving it. All right. My last two axolotls on the show today are these. They are ugly, cute, squeezy boba axolotl. So these are supposed to look like boba, but they are just full of water beads as well. I love this packaging. Hello. It's very cute. Ugly cute, if you will. So it's got some of my favorite things. It's an axolotl and it's boba and it's a squishy. It is just a typical water bead squishy. It's very sticky. It's going to get cloudy on the outside. But I'm guessing you can wash it, but yeah, it's so cute. Cuteness factor is 11 out of 10, but since it's just your basic water bead squish, I'm going to give it like seven and a half out of 10. This is so adorable. Holy cow, you guys, there were so many axolotls on the show today. Like, I mean, there was like a lot of axolotls today. So, 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 so many. So please make sure you have actually already commented to let me know which of these axolotls is the coolest one. So let's be honest. I actually can't believe there are that many different axolotl squishies out there and they're all so good. There was nothing like of the squishies that was below like a seven out of 10. I don't think, was there? Which one of these did you like the most? Was it the water bead squishy? Was it the cream filled squishies or the pop and eye squishies? Was it the sand axolotl or was it just my beanie belly? Oh my gosh, there are so many axolotls today. So I, if you have not commented, you are really, really bumming me out because I want to know your opinion on what's going on. So let me know what you thought and I will see you on the next show. Bye bye, squishy fans.